So here's what we're going to do. Please stick, stay close to your partner. Stay close to your partner. Perfect. So uh, please come to sway. So let's spread out. Just spread out where you are. Spread out. Spread out. Some people can come to the middle. Uh, please come. Please, you are safe. You are safe. Please come. Please come. Uh -huh. Now face your partner. Face your partner. Put your arms around her waist. Uh, Mom, please put your hands on their neck. Partner, face each other. So, whatever, I'm going to, once I come to you, you're going to do something with your partner. Either you kiss your partner, carry your partner, or do whatever you want to do. And the celebrants and a very lovely husband are going to replicate whatever you do. Have in mind, have in mind, you can't do what has been done before. You can modify. You can edit. So I'm starting with you, man. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go. Whatever you want to do. No, it needs to be. Go again, please. Exactly. This one I will do. Alright. Well. Alright. Your turn. When her eyes kissing. Both eyes, okay? Okay? Alright. Sama, please go. Ah. 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 Alright. Alright, the next couple. Alright. So you have to redo it. So we'll get that count. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Let's go one more time. Do it again with this seat. Oh, good, I love it. One, perfect. Two, okay. Okay, have you done yours? Please go. You've not done. Oh, okay, okay, sorry, sorry. I want you to do it again. Now, then. Right, let's go. No, you can't go. Please wait till you're done again. Please go, your turn, your turn. Alright. Master, please go. Okay, alright, ladies and gentlemen. The last one on the list. Please go. Please go. We can't see it though. Okay. Ah. The celebrant, please. Please. Please don't be. Ah. Right. Nothing I'll ever see here today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, they need to get sunglasses. Ah. ah. Where's sunglasses? Ah, let's go, let's go. Perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, please can put our hands together for them. Can we put our hands to your partner's life? Just pray, just pray. You know what your partner wants, just prophesy, just pray for them. What you want to see in the next five years, what you want to see in the next ten years, begin to say it into their life. What you want to see in the next five years, ten years. Pray, 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 pray for your partner. What you want to see in the next five, the next ten years. The beautiful wives, everyone please go behind. I want the men in front. Wives behind, men in front, stand side by side. Side by side, ladies at the back, women at the back. Men, please come forward. That's perfect. Come forward. Come. But can we spread out to fit in on the same line? Is it possible? Side. Okay. Side. Can you? Okay. Face front. A bit. Just look ahead. Perfect. Uh -huh. So please come. You can fit in. Yes. Come. come forward. Come forward. But no, just come forward. Perfect. So please come forward. Just come and stand here. Alright, so here's what we're doing. I want, can we all close our eyes? The men, close your eyes. So, your wives at the back, they are going to say, please, can we kill the sound, please? I beg. Thank you. Your wives at the back, they are going to say, baby, I love you. Once you're sure that's the voice of your wife, you put your hands up. No pet names, yes. It is, baby, I love you. Men, can we close our eyes? Baby, I love you. Is that your wife? Please put your hands together for him. Put your hands together for him. Alright, the next person. Close your eyes. Still close your eyes. Close your eyes, sir. Please close your eyes. Baby, I love you. Uh, you don't use some stretch the land. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Joe, don't enter this thing, but it is allowed. But please, baby, I love you is. 
Baby, I love you. All right, the next person, let's go. Baby, I love you. Ah, this one came in the full score. All right, so we have three over three. All the other men are praying in tongues seriously. Say this one where everybody don't get a go, they're very good. All right, let's go. Ah. Well, uh. All right, Ma, please go again with your real voice. Please let's close our eyes. Thank you. Again? Baby, I love you. Okay. Ah, please put your hands together. All right, the next person, let's go. We have four over four. Baby, I love you. Okay. He raised up his hand with one mind and spirit. Say, God, I pray this is it. All right, all right, let's go. Baby. Oh, Joro, now we enter. Oh, Joro, now enter. All right, we have six over six. The next, the next person. Baby, I love you. All right. The way she said that, baby, I love you, with warning. Baby, I love you. If you fail this thing. All right. All right. One. All right. Let's go. Baby, I love you. Okay. Uh, okay. Somebody go get queen this night. All right. Again, again. Ah. Uh, okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Can we put our hands together for them? Come on. All right, the last one before you go back to your seat. Please pick your partner. Just this is the last one before you go back. Mommy can't say you picked me. Smart one. Alright, so the next one Daddy and Mommy, who is always with their phone? Most times, who's always with their phone? Who's always with their phone. Alright, please face your hands and face your hands. Alright, Daddy and Mommy, who do you think likes food more? Who do you think likes food more? Okay, we did the black school. Alright, alright. So, if you, among that, if, if something probably you misplaced something or something got missing, and you want to tell one of them, the person that won't, that you want to tell that won't get annoyed immediately, what are you going to tell? What are you going to tell? 
Sorry? It depends on what it is. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I'll put our hands together for that. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.
put our hands together, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much.
and Zan, bro. He wants a great Seven years ago. Hallelujah! Is it because she's seven? <laughs> she should be forgotten. No! Call them minor. She is minor. So she should be celebrated like a minor. And however, I remember that Jama was born on the 11th of August. Okay. Okay. Seven years ago. And I've been thanking God for that arrangement. Because that's the first time I have had a woman giving birth to her own daughter. On the same day, she too was born. Is it not wonderful? Yes. I've been happy with that of God. Because of them, I have gone through the Bible quite a lot of I have gone through the Bible to know if there is any such arrangement in the Bible. When God allowed a woman to give back to a daughter or a son, on the same day she was brought to the world.
She's a jolly good fan. And so says all of us. And so says all of us. And so says all of us. For she's a jolly good fan. She's a jolly good fan. For she's a jolly good fan. Join me, join me, join me, say So says all of us Alright, so we come to one, two, three Are we ready? I want you all to join me When I say one Everybody repeat after me One Two Two And three Can you please put your hands Please come on, come on, make some noise I'm gonna make some noise and please come, come join the silence. Real quick. City of David, please get ready. City of David, please get ready.
in the middle of 360, all right? For now, we're going to have your celebrant vote of thanks. Brass Sound Band will give us beautiful music. Yes, I I'm sure if you, if you listen close, you hear my voice. This is how 40, 40 years old she's sounding. Those, those of us that are on this side, you understand? If you're not sounding like this, that means you're probably still on the other side. Don't worry, you'll come join us. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys for, for coming to join me to celebrate with me. Most especially to thank God with me. For, for those who made it to church with us today, when I gave my little speech, I said, this birthday for me is all about thanking God. It's, it's like, um, it's very easy for people for, for one to wake up and go to bed every day. That's what we think. That's what we think. But most times you find out that people who die, on the day they die, they probably didn't wake up thinking that was going to be the end. There is no... It just, you don't just know when that day and time will be. And I've actually come to realize that this thing called death is not just for the old people these days. You hear very young people who are passing for whatever reason. You hear some... Without illness, people just sleep and don't wake up or just something. So for me, being alive, I think, is a big deal. Why? Because I've had friends, I've known classmates, I've known people who didn't even get to 40 and they passed. So for me, seeing 40 right now, maybe before now I would not have thought it was a big deal. But I think it is a big deal. It is a big deal. Being alive, irrespective of the age, that you're here right now, kids have passed, infants have died. So that we are here today, we can dance, we can move, it's a big deal. And I think my, my being thankful today, first off, is the fact that I'm, I'm, I'm among the living. And then, secondly, not just that you are among the living, we are where we are. Because a lot of people will think they're going through stuff, but trust me, it can be worse or it could have been worse. So let's just stay thankful. And once again, thank you all sincerely for coming to join me in thanking God for these 40 years on earth. Thank you guys. And may celebration not cease in your homes. People shall join and celebrate you as well. People will celebrate you. Most of you didn't make it to church. I thank my husband for being it's never too much, right? It's never too much. So, for this husband of mine, this husband of mine that is arms, thank you so much. Like I said in church, I think he has gotten to the point where he has decided his mission on earth is to give me a soft life. That's, 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 that's all he's giving for right now. So I think if there's a smile on my face, if I can confirm that I'm on the soft life level, then he's happy. You know, the, the way as a parent, as a mother, or as a father, as a parent, if your children are happy, at this stage you're like, ah, my kids are happy, I'm happy. So for him, he has decided to put me first before himself. So the fact that I'm happy makes him happy. I'm not ignorant of that fact. I'm not ignorant of that fact. And that's why I want to say thank you. Thank you for loving me. And for my parents, I want to say a big thank you to them. In fact, as a matter of fact, I'm sure they know. They all love Texas. My elder sister is here. You know the way, like, when the care is too much, they're like, well, fine, well, it's okay. That's how they are they with us. Their own love is excess, it's choking us. So, that way, I want to say, we were raised with so much love. We were raised with so much love. And maybe it would have been a very difficult thing for me to cope if after being raised where I was raised, to end up with a partner who wasn't giving me what I was used to. But God made it in such a way that I'm with a partner who is giving me much more. Much more. I said in church today that I think 
God is overdoing himself with me. You know the way you have a parent and he has a favorite child. I think I'm his favorite child indeed. He's like, he's over, he's over walking the thing with me. So I'm not ignorant of that fact and that's why he decided that just maybe my 40 years on earth was, it's not coincidental like it's on his Sunday. He, can, he couldn't have gone any other way. That's the way you love me so much.